Hydrogen. It is the lightest and most abundant element in the universe. It has a very high energy content by mass and so has huge potential use in the energy industry. There are different colors assigned to the various methods of producing hydrogen, such as gray, blue, pink, and green hydrogen, although the hydrogen molecule itself is chemically the same. The purpose of the color coding is to define groups of hydrogen by their carbon footprint, and the methods of producing green hydrogen are associated with the lowest carbon footprint. Green hydrogen can be used in the form of hydrogen, or it can be converted into other derivatives, such as green methanol, green ammonia, sustainable aviation fuel, and e-fuels. Therefore, at MOSTA, we believe that green hydrogen has an important role in the future energy mix, as it will be a key factor in the global decarbonization efforts to effectively reduce the emissions of what are referred to as hard to abate sectors, such as industry, aviation, and maritime. Master has always been a pioneer. We are focusing firstly and most importantly on our own backyard. We have already kick-started two strategic projects here in Abu Dhabi, positioning Abu Dhabi as one of the global hubs for the production and export of green hydrogen, where we aim strategically to produce at least half of our capacity here in Abu Dhabi. Of course, we look globally across our entire uh, footprint, starting with a project which we have launched in Egypt, four gigawatt electrolyzer capacity. We are planning similar capacity in Morocco, and we have ambitions to expand our footprints to many regions globally for the production of hydrogen and derivatives. We have kick-started back in January 2021 our Green Falcon project that aims to produce around two tons of green hydrogen per day. The biggest bulk of that green hydrogen is going to be transformed to sustainable aviation fuel, green kerosene, that is already committed as an offtake to Etihad Airlines and Lufthansa.